full blown out relationship with someone else. My thing is, just leave me alone. Leave me, just go on, leave me alone. That's all you gotta do. Don't tag me along because I have goals and dreams that I'm trying to achieve. What's up, Astro Bays? It's your girl, Joy and Bobby. Bobby. Bobby's in town. From full. She's here for the summer. She's working an internship, honey. I told y'all about that. You can check out the other video of her giving you guys an update. And so we're about to head to Starbucks. There's some work, but I was hungry. It's 2 11. Is this the ideal meal? No. But honey, it's time for a break fast, okay? I done fasted to 2 o'clock. And at this point, I already eat my arm off. So I got me some Burger King. And this little baby whopper. This is a baby whopper. I'm gonna still be hungry? I just thought it meant like small fries. I didn't know it's like meant for like, you know, young folk. And they didn't have my zesty sauce. Whenever I go to Burger King, I get zesty sauce. Look. Yo, that is that's I'm gonna be that's why I was five dollars. Oh well it'll have to do. They didn't have my zesty sauce, so I'm trying honey mustard sauce. Open this one. Mm -hmm. I'm trying the honey mustard sauce, but honey, I came on here to give y'all the tea. Okay? And I always say don't do a video. I don't know how I'm gonna like this. Uh, yeah, don't put it on the whole thing yet. I'll put it on the bite. I'm gonna put it on the bite. And I went with the zesty sauce too. Because in New York, we would do this thing called a knish. And it's like a it's like a fried potato patty. And then, then you would slice it open and you put mustard on it. So I wanted to try that with the with the fries, with the honey mustard. So here we go. We're gonna get into this first bite, huh? I'm hungry. I'm hungry, y'all. So, calm down, calm down. Some people have been saying, where you at, where you been? You make me nervous, you need to give updates. Well, actually, since Bobby is home for the summer, doing her internship, we're in a, um, extended state hotel i always said if the kids come home something like that i will always have an airbnb but those airbnbs they'd be expensive so it's not the greatest place and it's not the worst so it'll do and she's loving her internship but guess who was all up in my closet only be only because my internship is business casual and I didn't have business casual clothing. So homegirl, been all up in my storage job. All up in there, okay? But I don't mind, so we went to storage yesterday and baby, she had a field day. She's like, I'll take this, I'll take this, I'll take that. I was like, well, I could wear that this week too. And it's nice for her to you know, get a sense of what work clothes are like and so on and so forth. But listen, 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 listen. I'm not going to keep you long. And another thing, my camera is broken. And I have to try to find a place to repair it because I don't have $1,000 to replace it at this time. My computer, my Apple computer is acting up. It keeps saying, um, what did I said it, it keeps saying? Something this full? Yeah this full this full i'm like i don't even keep any i don't even store stuff up on there so i don't understand scratch this full so i don't know i need to make an appointment with apple i tried to google it and for last though it's going over my head y'all so anyway mm. excuse me what? 
Let's get the onion ring and a honey mustard. Mm -hmm. That's good. I'm not a fan of honey mustard. That was good though, Barbie. How was the iced tea? Oh, it's okay. You have a mm -mm. Oh. I'm hungry. Burger King's onion rings are really good. Mm hmm. Very good. So. I got y'all propped up on this phone. So anyway, as I was doing a video, I said I kind of have one foot in, one foot out of the car, of the car life, right? I still need to get my joint, just in my bed fixed. And it's not bad. I feel cozy in it when I'm in here. And I said, sometimes I would stay at Bay Daddy's house. I would stay at a friend's house. Now I've been staying at the hotel. Then I, you know, be daddy. Somebody was like, I thought y'all broke up. And we did. <laughs> mm. But we were friends. You know. And we happened to spend a little more time together. Whatever. But. It's like, ooh. Sorry, I'm hungry. Yeah, you eating like you ain't ate in three weeks. Hungry. <laughs> it ain't going nowhere. It's okay. It's hungry. okay. <laughs> so listen, 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 listen. And so, it's like you with somebody, but you're not with them. But it's kind of like it's under giving, hmm? it's giving situationship. Right, situationship. It's not a relationship, but. It's more than just friends, kind of, so to speak. It's just a situation. Just like there's a situation, right? But the situation is like you still kind of mm -hmm. one on one, mm -hmm. not one two three, or not one two three four. You feel me? You feel me? Are you picking up what I'm putting down? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But it's like fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. And I take it. I take the shame, I, I'll take it. So I fell into, you know, old ways a little bit. Mm. I got comfortable with certain things. I got comfortable, but I wasn't stupid. There was always something in the back of my mind that said something's just not right. So, ladies, like I said, I'm not going to make this long. You got to trust your instincts. And whatever is done in the dark, you best to believe, hunty. It will come to the light. And whatever is done in the dark, you best to believe, hunty. It will come to the light. It may not come to the light that day that week that month or that year but best believe something's gonna show up and tell you the truth and i thank god oh he delivered yes he did he delivered honey mm. jesus i don't like the tea it's too bland sometimes when i eat i want something to burn my throat you're the one who said tea i know i didn't know what to order sprite or mm. even like a root beer mm. Mm -hmm. This little burger is hitting. And anything would have been hitting because I was hungry. So listen, listen, listen. I'm going to give you a story time. So one thing, this is a red flag. Always trust your instincts. I went to grab their phone. Almost broke my arm, child. They would have done anything for me not to look at that phone. Red flag. Ladies, that's a red flag. Or they always keep their phones with them and don't want you looking at the phone. Red flag. That's a red flag. Even takes the phone to the bathroom. Wherever they go. Red flag. If you don't got nothing to hide, you could go through my phone. You could go through my phone. And one thing I don't like is a liar is a liar is a liar i can't I, I don't like liars i don't like liars 
So, whatever, that was in the back of my head. And then something else happened. Um, something else happened. I don't want to talk about that, but it was a red flag, another red flag, because you don't want me looking at certain things in your closet. Red flag. And it was just little things. It was just little things, but it was always back there. They're saying, watch yourself and don't get too comfortable because something just isn't right. And I already knew. I should have I should have known better from the first time. I should have known better. So it's my fault. I'll take it. It's on me. It's on me. But you, know, you talk, try to give people benefit of the doubt, another chance. But baby. Mm -mm. I should have stuck to my hard no. But that's all right. You live and you learn and you keep it moving. That's what life is about. But always be aware and trust your instincts. So, ladies, or even men, if you're in a situation and there's something just not right, and you see little inconsistencies and red flags. So, I woke up in the middle of the night for the restroom, and I something just said, Joy. Because there's no lock on the Apple Watch. Although you could put one on there, but it's annoying as hell. So most people don't have a lock on the Apple Watch. It's annoying. I had one on mine. I took it off. What did I have to hide anyway? Nothing. So what do I need a lock on mine for? You can have my phone code. You can go through my phone. You can scroll through my phone. Because I don't have anything to hide. You're not going to see deleted messages. You see parts of messages and conversations because the other one's been deleted. You think I was born yesterday? I used to be a player. A player can't play a player, player. I guess I did get played, but that we're not talking about that. So I go through the Apple Watch and you look at the messages. Boom! All the proof I needed to let me know I wasn't crazy. All of my things that was swirling in my head that was just like something just isn't right baby the veil was lifted from my eyes and now I can see clear and honestly not upset not upset a full blown out relationship with someone else a full blown out relationship with someone else my thing is, just leave me alone. Leave me, just go on, leave me alone. That's all you gotta do. Don't tag me along because I have goals and dreams that I'm trying to achieve. But you know what? Now I know and now I'm free. <laughs> I'm already planning my trip after summer school is over. I got my first trip planning. That's what I'm gonna do, Bobby and I gonna do when we go to Starbucks because now I'm free, I, I'm free, I, I'm free, I've been released. And now they have been released, they can pursue that other uh, relationship in peace. And I wish them the best. But baby, I feel liberated. Do I, I feel like I wanna cry and stuff? Absolutely not. I feel like, thank you God, thank you for revealing what needed to be revealed so I could have the closure that I needed to move on. <laughs> It will also expedite teaching abroad because that was something I've always thought about. So now I'm going to start working on that application. That application process can take a while. Oh, uh, baby. And initially, in the very beginning, when I met Bay Daddy, I did not want a relationship. I just finished a 10 year relationship with someone I, 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 I really love. I just finished. I just wanted, I didn't, I didn't want it anymore. I wanted to be free. So now, baby, if somebody looks at me, tries to talk to me, 
I probably duck my head in like a turtle. You do not see me. You don't see me. I'm not here. <laughs> I'm not interested. I just want to live my life in peace. No drama. No lies. Deceit. None of that. You can't stand a liar. But I will say, and I will admit, I got played this time. My fault. So shame on me for allowing someone to come back into my life. That's my fault. But I saw the flags and now I feel great. I feel great. What are your thoughts, Bobby? So they've been blocked on everything. And if I have to, they they, they just just leave me alone. Cause I'll be going to the next to the next level. Just leave me alone. Don't talk to me. Don't find me. Don't look for me. Nothing. Or else I'll be getting a restraining order. How did you feel when I told you, Bobby? I I was very surprised because that was the last thing. That I was I surprised thought. too. That was truly the last thing that I thought would have happened. Very last thing. Very very last thing. Wasn't even in the realm of my mind. But they always say like whenever something is too good to be true. That's not what you was gonna say. No, that's, that's not saying. what I was gonna say. But yeah, it probably is. And then they have the gift of gab. To gift the lying gab mm -hmm. but it's my fault I will I will take the blame all the blame I dropped my guards again and I already knew what I was working with you know what I'm saying so it's my fault and I, I, I wish I wish them the best I'm just glad that I'm aware and I can move on with my life yeah so sorry I cut you off Bobby that's okay like you were saying like whenever you are in a situation and you become a choice I wouldn't ever want to be a choice like pick the other person because once you're a choice then it's like obviously they don't love you the way you think they do if they're thinking about somebody else so if I would if I was ever a choice don't pick me right don't pick me and, and the so, way the conversation went yeah when things were going down they picked they picked the other which kind of stung a little bit. I was like, oh, oh okay. Oh, all right, do you. Mm, they'll be back. Mm -mm. There's, there's, there's no. And I, I'm telling y'all, on my mama's grave, y'all better curse me out. Curse me out, dog me out. If I ever backslide with the same lying person again, curse me out. Come and get me and shake me. I'm going to give you the address for you to come and get me and shake me. But that's it, y'all. So I'm excited. When summer school is over, Bob is going to try to help me plan my first trip somewhere. But this is this is what I wanted to do. So I don't know. So I slept in my car last night. In my sleep, I was still going back and forth over what happened in my head, back and forth, back and forth. But um, so I slept. And then, child, I heard a couple arguing, saying, you can't be trusted. And in, in the car, I was like, you right, girl. <laughs> you right, girl. You dealing with that, too? <laughs> and then she was like, something. You can't be trusted, Brett. We've been through this before. So I guess we both been burnt before. <laughs> and I was in the car. That's right, girl. That's right, girl. You know, she couldn't hear me. But, I, baby, I was on her side. <laughs> It was so funny. But I was all up in their conversation at 3.30 in the morning. So I'm like waking me up at that time. Didn't bother because my sleep was in and out. I was just too hyped at that point. But I was like, that's right, girl. You tell them, girl. <laughs> so I hope that she finds her peace. I hope whoever is going through something, trust your instincts. If something just doesn't feel right in your spirit, then baby, you can always go to the watch, honey. The watch. Okay, because most people don't lock their watch because it's annoying. Every time you want to look at it, you got to put a code. Who's doing that? Not me. Nobody. Because it's on your arm anyway. But baby. Mm -hmm. But like you said, if you go looking for something, you're going to find it. That's right. It was meant for me to find. <laughs> Period. <laughs> Period. So leave your thoughts below. Call me stupid. Call me whatever. But I'm aware. And that's what life is about. You live and you learn. Sometimes you forgive. Sometimes you get burnt. And you keep it moving. Keep it moving. 
But baby, something was back there from the initial breakup. It just, something wasn't right. Or I just, the trust wasn't all the way there after everything went down. But I let my guards down a little bit because it was there. Because if my guards were all the way down, I would have never picked up the phone. I just would have believed everything they said. No! Go ahead, dog me out if you want to, but that's what life is about. You go through these things and you keep it moving. Keep it moving. Don't be sitting here crying and stuff. You pick your head up and know your worth. And I definitely know mine, honey. Yes, I do. I know my worth, baby. So you go right along and do you because I'm going to do me. And I just want peace, serenity. I'm at that age where I can't do drama and I can't do liars. Mm -mm. The, the, just let me go bye and like I said I used to be a player back in the day can't play a player baby can't play a player shorty you know my player days are over cause I don't got time for all that nonsense and I don't know if I'll I never want to say never but I don't think I'll, it'll be a long time before I allow someone else back into my life and if I do it will have to be someone who's a traveler and someone who has the same goals and aspirations that I do but they have to have their own goals and dreams and then we can combine them together but a sister is not looking ah! no time soon I need peace my healing my spirituality to become one and check Stop. oh you didn't watch that show what was that movie y'all with uh, Angela Bassett you gotta watch it Bobby it's the rite of passage you gotta watch it she burned all his clothes child mm -hmm. I wish I was there to burn his clothes with the, with the big house in Arizona so when I watched that movie I always wanted to move to Arizona so I've been thinking about the Grand Canyon, but Arizona is hot. Arizona is hot. Mm -hmm. This is it's too hot for Arizona. So maybe I need to start going to the pool area at my gym, which is very nice. Very Excuse nice. me, very nice. You can order food. They have like three or four different uh, pool areas. They got indoor pools, outdoor pool, lap pool, lounge pool, a big water slide. And then, honey, sometimes I like to put on a two-piece, honey, and wear some heels and walk to my seat. <laughs> I need to get, I think I may, I may need to get a one-piece. Wow. Nah, but There's cute one-pieces, though. I don't like one-pieces. They're very cute one-pieces. But rock the two-piece. I'm thick, y'all. Rock the two-piece. I'll I, I post a picture, a picture that Bobby and I took. We went to the gym. What was it, yesterday? Mm-hmm. Rock I'll show y'all. Y'all tell me if I should rock a one piece or a two piece. Y'all leave it in the comment section below. Okay, I love y'all, but summer school has been kicking my butt and my computer is acting up, my camera is broken. So now that I'll have more time and not listening to the, the gab from a liar, so I'll have more time to spend with y'all. You know, the people who who love me and some people who hate me and that's okay you just do you hate basil you hate basil i'm okay with that everybody's not gonna like a basil just just don't lie keep it 100 you know just like the person said i'm irresponsible okay then i'm irresponsible you because you making all the right decisions and moves in your life and if i wanted to talk about fighting with my daughter it was just a conversation but i want to know if she could fight if she could defend herself you never know if you're going to put in a situation. You better go into, do I want to start in fights and stuff? No. But if it comes down to protecting herself, you better act like you crazy. When did this come up? What are we talking about? Last time when we did the video at the hotel and I asked if you knew how to fight. Oh. Somebody said I'm irresponsible. Oh. Because violence is never the answer. Violence is never the answer. But if I have to defend myself, baby. I'm fighting dirty, I'm biting, I'm picking up stuff, I'm breaking bottles. Yes, I am. You put your hands on me, I'm putting my hands right back on you. What you gonna do? Just stand there and let somebody beat you up and let a student hit me. It'll probably be the same way. I don't know how I'll react. Student punches me in the face. Hello, welcome to McDonald's. <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to react. I don't know. 
I, I don't know. So, no. So, I want to know, what can she do? We need to sign you up for karate? Mm -mm. I feel like, I don't know. I feel like if it came down to it, I, something would kick in. Yeah. But, I, but I'm not the type of person where anybody would fight me, like, for real. But, like, in a dire situation. Yeah. Like, like, some, you know, your instinct would just kick in. I'd probably become... Who's a, who's a fighter? I don't know. Mayweather. Floyd Mayweather. I'm going to become like him. Or and you got that crazy. <laughs> you got that sore at once. You got that crazy in you. And let somebody try to um, pull up on my child. I'm going to be one telling her to stand back. I got this. Baby, please. Call me irresponsible. But when it comes to protecting myself or protecting my children. Mm, you remember when I went looking for those boys who was teasing Clinton? Mm -hmm. Yes, I did. Did I have on a wig? I think I took my wig off. No, it was, I didn't. No, you did not. How was my hair then? Was I was wearing wigs, or was I? It wearing might have been short. I don't know, but I went. Ago. I went searching for those boys. I was like, "Get your mama." Nobody was gonna be messing with my son, yeah, even though he be getting on my. He was young at that point. Oh, he was crying. He was embarrassed. Oh yeah. well, don't mess with my children. Don't mess with my children. The mama bear and all the pandas came out. Okay. Yes. So call me irresponsible if you want to. Am I going to go around starting fights? No. <laughs> but if you started, I'm going to finish that hoe. Period. Period. Yes, I am. Yes. That's how you do it? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, I grew up in Brooklyn, bro, so I know how to scrap. You've been in a fight before? Yes. Really? Yeah, this girl wanted to fight me in fourth grade. Let's just say. Fourth grade. That's not, I'm just saying. She was like, she was like six feet tall. And I was a little short. And she wanted to fight me. I didn't know what I was doing. But I know she had my head a certain way. And I was just giving her those uppercuts. You know they want to do it. They bring like butterfly punches. And I was giving her uppercuts, uppercuts in her stomach, right? <laughs> and um, so everybody was like, woo, woo. And I thought I was bad, that she was kind of scared of me. And then I was like, mm, I want to fight her again. You know, when you're young, silly. I want to fight her again, child. I didn't go so well, but, you know, so I did the best I could, but. Uh -huh, right. I did the best I, I could. Stayed in your land. I know. I should have just left it at that win. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know why you did that. Because I know the punches want to do nothing, but it, was, it looked good, though. Like, boom, 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 boom. It was probably like little butterfly tags. So, so anyway, I know. I gave y'all the tea and had to give y'all a whole time. Now, I'm hoping that I can edit this video on my computer. It just has not been working well. But then again, I can edit on my phone. But then I don't know how to get my introductions. You could probably airdrop them into your on All your right. phone. So if I like can't edit on my computer, I try to do it on my phone. And then next week, I promise to take my camera to the repair shop. It turns on. It just it won't stay on. And with all the moving, it's been in my backpack and just probably just banged up really bad. Okay, guys, if you are still here, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for hanging out with me and getting this tea, honey. Getting this tea hot off the press. This is literally hot off the press. I'm going to try my best to upload this video today. And this hot off the press. So I really need to do some work. Okay, so maybe today or tomorrow, okay? <laughs> mm -hmm. I gotta get, because I have to get ready for summer school. And if I don't do this little work, it's just going to put me behind. And then I have to do 30 hours of professional development, online professional development classes. So with that said, I love you. And thank you for hanging in there with me. Jackie Newton, your thing is still sitting in my car. My goal is to ship that out next week. Because after summer school, I probably head to the gym, try to get this body snatched, honey, and sit by the pool like a goddess that I am, like a queen. Let me see. I got to find my bathing suits. They are in storage somewhere. Fine. There, I said it. No, I'm not back on the market because I don't want another relationship. But it doesn't hurt to look. <laughs> well, you my age, honey. Any looks you get, you be like, hey. <laughs> I still got it a little bit. All right, guys, give this video a thumbs up or not. Until next time, later. Okay, bye. We got to do the head thing one more time. What did I say before? You don't remember? No. Okay, so I was like, until next time, later. Doop.
Okay. All right, guys. So until next time, later.